There we go. Ahoy everyone, welcome aboard. I'll be your Captain Hillian tonight, along with... This is Mike Lutendrick here at your service. <laughs> and welcome yeah, back. Okay. <laughs> welcome back again to Sonic Heroes. Our fifth stream of, of this about this, because we finished with both of these teams in about two streams each. So yeah, that means it's <laughs> Team Rose's turn today. Uh, <laughs> but yeah. <laughs> <laughs> There's one big annoyance with this team, though, and well, we'll see that in a moment once we get started. We're up. You can count on me. Okay, here we go. And again, that's Duke Nukem's voice. getting shoved into the water <laughs> uh, but oh, yeah when God. we get when we start with this game we get put into stage zero which is well the tutorial no <laughs> i looked at something off right away what then Sometimes I say Umashao. Yeah. But he did not see Umashao. Each formation is different depending on who the leader is. Press the Y button or the X button to change leaders and try different formations. <laughs> Hello, there in chat, Dark Knight the... Luigi. You doing well yourself? Hello. Doing decent myself? <laughs> Sorry. Hello, Luigi. Do well. Let's uh, see. The voice actor for Umashao said Umtao. <laughs> Oh, thank <laughs> We can skip. Okay. Let's let's try and get through this as quickly as possible. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, uh, shut up. <laughs> let's speed run this stupid stuff. <laughs> oh, you haven't played this game. <laughs> From what I have gathered, this is the game... Like, Amy Rose has been usually seen up to this point uh, before this game as just annoying but this game is the one that stalked the Amy hate now I'm pretty sure that started earlier because well since the very start she was obsessed with Sonic yeah this would be able to explain that she was people found it annoying at the beginning is a fangirl 
But this is the one people feel like even from just fangirl to outright creepy <laughs> and more and just too much apparently. So it yeah, could be quite very, very annoyed over her to just hating her. <laughs> Uh, since this is very likely the very first game that I <laughs> that I played of the Sonic series, uh, <laughs> I did not get that bad of an impression out from her. Uh, th th that's what I gather so far from watching lore videos and people talking about Amy. <clears throat> it seems that many of them repeated the damn same thing. <laughs> Here we go. Okay, the third is great to hear. Never played this game. It is. Flawed, but it is overall still very good. Like, there are clearly some places where the developers just completely miss stuff. <laughs> uh, shut up, Omachow. And. <laughs> yeah, big just belly flops all over the place if we do that. <laughs> uh, how to say this, uh, Luigi? Oh, good god, that's what you say. This is the game that made her outright unlikable level. Hmm. What did you say? You're unlikable to a lot of people. Yeah, when the characters has become outright a stalker level, or almost yonder or something, that they, some has said her, called her. Yeah, that's a problem. <laughs> And of course, Biggs' his last attack is with this freaking fishing pole. <laughs> uh, let's see, I'm not sure if it was Sega's first GameCube game. But it is definitely, uh, yeah. <laughs> it was definitely made for it, though. And I'm going to save the Team Blast until it's actually uh, <laughs> more fun to show it. Yeah, shut up. Okay. This, this, all of this is just basic info. <laughs> and out. <laughs> um. uh, yeah. <laughs> Big basically what? hula hooping without the hoop. <laughs> Let's see, they ported most of their IPs to the GameCube until this one, if I'm correct. I mean, in the Sonic series. I Actually, now that I think about it, I, I think the only other Sonic that maybe was on the GameCube was Sonic Adventure DX. Anyways, now on to the actual gameplay. Or actual story of the game. And, uh, yeah. Be careful not to fall off! <laughs> yeah, since Team Rose is, well, the easy modes will, well... They have things a lot easier playing as them, of course. And well, we'll see a lot more of the gates and such. One. <laughs> okay. And it worked. Okay, face through the floor there for a second. If I recall correctly, this is like the third playable appearance of Cream the Rabbit or so. I think she first appeared in Sonic Advance 2. Okay, uh, let's see. I think I heard mention that her mother has not been seen in a game in 25 years or something? For a long time, I think. <laughs> what? What's going on, Amy? <laughs> yeah, I, I don't recall ever seeing Vanilla in any of the games. I've seen her re-reference to... But the only time I actually know her having seen... Oh. Yes, yes, shut up, Amy. You can hear a little bit of Duke Nukem in there. <laughs> but yeah, to my knowledge, I've never seen Vanilla in any of the games. Like, I've seen her in Sonic X, but... 
only referenced in any of the games that I've played, which has been the most comprehensive uh, catalog of the series, but still. Uh, if I remember right from what I've been gathering so far, she might have only appeared in the first game Cream uh, uh, appeared in. Would make sense. Uh, let's see. Da -da -da. Dark, uh, Dark Knight Luigi DX is available in Japan on the Dreamcast. Cool fact. She did in fact appear in the Sonic Advance series. Do you mean vanilla there, <laughs> Luigi? Uh, have you ever heard? Uh, yes, I I have that game, the Sonic Chronicles. <laughs> Maybe vanilla showed up there. Anyways, that's the first level done. And yeah, since Team Rose is the easy egg team, is the easy mode team. Also, I forgot to do something. Uh, did I put that in the wrong order? Uh, yes, I did. I put it in the wrong order. There we go. There you go. And just to remind people, big a cat is a cat. Super happy. Who is super happy? <laughs> and he's. 18 years old here. <laughs> Let's see. Have you ever played a Nintendo DS RPG? No, oh, right. We we got the key, so <laughs> very easy. Even though we don't really need this too much, like I guess we can get some lives, but it's the easy mode. It's the easy mode team. Uh, for Luigi. It's so advanced too. You're correct in the first appearance. Okay, so I did remember. I am very new to Sonic lore. <laughs> Since, again, I said the similar for I am almost avoiding Sonic due to I grew up with the bad, the bad Sonic cartoon. Yeah, for more the Looney it. Tunes one. Not even that, it was more like a drug trick or something. <laughs> But yeah, I, I honestly can't remember ever seeing Vanilla herself in any of the games, again, that I've played myself. Mm. Uh, uh, what the? Okay, controls just stopped working there for a second. I think something might have dis de de deselected the game. Oh, yeah, I should say this is Aren't you made two cartoons at the same time? No, so, but I believe that they didn't release the, 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 the cartoons at the same time. They released the bad one first, then later showed out, out uh, the old, other good one later. But one was love, this appearance is called Saturday Sonic. The liked one is nicknamed Sonic Set AM because it mostly showed, well, in Saturday mornings. Uh, and the other, I believe, is called uh, nor by fans and just officially uh, yeah, The Adventures of Sonic the Hedgehog. Alright! Yeah. Uh, let's see. Uh. Didn't watch Sonic on the ground that much. I yeah, that, that actually reminds me of. There was a third one in that time called Sonic Underground, I believe, where you actually had two siblings and. That's yeah. a bunch of levels. <laughs> Love, me. A bunch of levels. I thought that one was the part of the good one as well, because. Well. Julius Robotnik looked the same there, so I thought. Huh. And they're still same robot, so I guess it's, a, it's the season two or something? I did not know it was supposed to be a separate series. Wow, what a beautiful bright palette. Amy, we're not even striking. And I should clarify how I thought it. Like, the only one I was growing up with, sad enough. However, Saturday AM and Underground, I only got to see the intros before having to leave the school. Oh, yeah. Here we go. <laughs> So it was very rare I got to see anything of them, unless I was sick or something. Let's see... Dark Knight Luigi grew up on the... grew up to Sonic because of uh, the cartoon series and comics that came out from Archie Comics. 
I, I don't think Archie comics had anything to do with the uh, series. So calling it the Archie TV series would be a misnomer. I think it was them actually. Or was it IDW? Yeah, both of those are comic uh, uh, companies. I don't think they would have a hand in the shows. They, actually, they, they, they actually had a hand in the, the, in the two first shows. Mm -hmm. It's like I explain one, why was, one was good and one was oh, the one was horrible. <laughs> yep. Slightly I mean, messed it up, but we don't no. need a key. I think it was more they were based of the, on the comics and, and not made by the comics. Hmm. If that makes sense. That's a bloody complicated the history. Yeah, I need to look into that, but I, to my knowledge, yeah. there was no direct connection between the comics and the shows at the time. And to be honest, there still isn't today. Or at least there isn't today. Okay. <laughs> yep, we uh, <laughs> going down the other path. <laughs> And yeah, Big is just still just of one single mind. Get the freaking frog. <laughs> okay. I'm not sure if I've said this before, but if you go into the cannons as the power character, you can actually aim and fire of your own accords. Oh dear. Uh, that, that, that's the sermon, because you know, that means you have uh, too much power already. <laughs> Let's see, Dark Knight Luigi, Archie Comics is where the adventures of Sonic continues. It's been the longest comic series for a video game character. Look it up, there's even a crossover with Mega Man that is pretty interesting. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, from what I know, a lot of the comic readers do think very, very highly of the Sonic uh, of the Sonic comics. Yeah, I feel like there was. I watched for the, uh, the videos. I apparently hate that one. Or the RDW for. Uh, Sounds like there might be two companies that did the, the, the uh, comics. Uh, two different times, I believe. And uh, hello. Uh, we did it! Okay, that's a first. <laughs> hmm. I have seen yeah. some videos seem to indicate the RG1 is good, but others seem to show they hate it. Like, there seems to be a divide going on. Kind of super duper happy! <laughs> if I recall oh, correctly, dear. Archie Comics came first with Sonic, and IDW picked up it later after they discontinued the original or something. <clears throat> oh dear. Well, time for the egg hawk. So you're the ones who are playing games with my army. Dr. Eggman! You little crap, I'll show you what they want to do. <laughs> egg hawk. Yeah. We only now know the Reddit. <laughs> no, no. That's not a thing. I think we may look it up. I think you said egg hawk. Egg Hawk. Yeah, I, I, okay. I'm different to make it if I misheard you or you missaid it for all oh, the Hawk can I actually misheard easily. Okay, but from, from the looks of it, the, the main body still has to sit, uh, a good amount of health, like 100 or so. But all the extra bits, like... Yeah. Give me some. Yeah. The extra bits yeah, yeah, yeah. have a lot less health from the looks of it. Okay. Now, if I recall correctly, there is a pretty decent way to... Uh, damn it. To, to get a lot of damage in. With this group, whenever he's sitting still, that is. It's, well, with Biggs' body slam, since it bounces up and down constantly. 
Or you, well, you can bounce with it. Okay. Just need to get him in place. Okay. Yep. Not that. There. Uh, yeah, this is basically this prob is probably the safest way to deal damage to this thing like that. <laughs> Since he cannot reach you. Here we go. Yeah. Well, it's a very big cat. Yep. <laughs> oh, because I should have accidentally made a pun. <laughs> yep. <laughs> yep. Wait, you know what? We, he's skipping this bit? Okay. You know what? Uh, I got, this could be a first thing. Monkey myself. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, come on. Oh, I, I, th I think we're going too fast for him. Ah! Yep. Come on, I don't uh, want to do that. I want to do this move. <laughs> there we go. And yeah, if Amy will use her hammer uh, if the others aren't close enough. Get, get into your freaking spot, you. Okay, I'm, I'm guessing when he's catching up like that, he will skip over if he if it's I mean, done too close. I mean, this thing shows some being interesting here. Uh, I don't know if I remember something. I think this actually may be inspired by a real design of a real airplane. Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> okay, that was mostly blocked. What the heck just happened? <laughs> this is <isn't> the end! <laughs> and we get oh, the invincibility no! move sound over that. <laughs> well, yeah, that's Team Rose's Team Blasts. And uh, why does Robot Eggman why sound like does he keep uh, making his machine? He does seem like they have different voice actors in each game. I had the same in the last two, in Adventure 1 and 2, I believe. But, yeah. <laughs> they must have switched out. Again? <clears throat> or switch out his personality hey, again. Master Sonic is here? No doubt Mr. about it. My heart is never wrong. Then it must be so. <laughs> what a huge plan. Where are you? Mm, we lose those. Okay, Big just speeding by at Mach 5. But yeah, we'll be going through the levels with this bunch quite a, well, quite fast because, well, the levels are also shorter. Here we go. Was that actually the fish and or not something else? That's an umbrella. Uh, oh, he hit with umbrella. <laughs> I thought he hit with a. Oh, what was it? Is it called uh, a poker? No. What? Uh, one of those uh, kendo swords made of bamboo. Yeah, okay, I believe that's just called a kendo stick. And I think it's actually a combination of the two. Yeah, well, it's. It yeah, I can see why I missed Tucky for one of them then for it, due to the animation it kinda looks like a bamboo sword. <laughs> but I, it, I, it is Biggs's uh, <clears throat> um, it's it's Biggs' uh, fishing rods mixed together with an umbrella. Which is honestly a quite smart idea, but it would probably not really work. Come on. Wait. No! No, that's a horrible like, idea! Up there. So much can yeah. go wrong with that idea! What the heck? Yeah, as long as the, the the reeling mechanism and such could be sufficiently isolated <laughs> or something. Uh, let's see, Dark Knight yeah. Biggs will speed <laughs> will run the speed of light <laughs> for Froggy. <laughs> He probably is 
you will have a very stiff rod. Level up. Not bad. <laughs> you, 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 you don't want that. Well, Big, Big is hardly using the most professional equipment with when he's fishing, huh? <laughs> yeah, but even the fishermen will use a uh, if they have a stick. We use a we use, we'll use a stick that can bend a little. In umbrellas, you don't want to be bendy. Yeah. So you see the problem here. My dad lose two don't mix. Either it be a horrible fishy rod or a horrible umbrella. Or in this case, both. Horrible at both. <laughs> Oh yeah. <laughs> she does that instead of the tornado spin around the uh, or tornado jump or whatever else it was called. Uh oh. I just realized something. Yep. May like, hmm? Amy not find Mjolnir. <laughs> She'll still do this <laughs> though. Uh, yes. She should very much not get it. Uh, if she were to find it, then Sonic is a dead hog. All right, I'll do my best. Here we go. Hedgehog, not a hog. Yeah, he'd be a dead hog, a dead hedgehog. Oh God. <laughs> yeah. Now, now I'm more and more convinced you accidentally said uh, egg hog instead of egg hog. <laughs> Oh well. A bloody but even I see I see that it sounds easy to misspeak mm. those two words. I still have no freaking clue if balancing actually does anything or not. But yeah, it, the longer we hold down, sure. the, the faster oh, we go. We go a lot faster when we hold it down instead of just hitting it again and again. I have a little bit of new shoes. Wait. I just knew we could do it. Big doesn't wear shoes. I'm pretty sure he does. Like I'm pretty sure every character you know, wears them. His his are just purple, the same color as his as his fur. Are you sure is they're not sandals? We can so, see this. Something that indicates they're sandals. Oh, right, yeah, th those are sandals. <laughs> okay. <laughs> the, those must be sturdy sandals to handle grinding for... Let's be honest, people. Sandals usually don't have a long lifespan. Yeah. Especially when they dry out and such. Yeah. I think that might actually be... Well, it is a certain type of sandal may become, uh, if not already become, outlawed. Uh, the flip-flop ones. Okay. You know those really cheap ones? Like uh, Crocs or such? Yeah, those. The really cheap, crappy ones. Yeah. I think that they got outlawed because so many, a lot of accidents happen because of them. And also they are, uh, have a different health hazard about them besides accidents. Yeah, what then? They attract a lot of bacteria. People actually develop a lot of foot diseases because of them. Okay. Uh, yeah, there we go it. with some upward momentum. <laughs> it's summer, it's warm. Where does the sweat go? Yeah. So yeah, and I think it was Australia who was first with banning them. <laughs> yeah, I could be wrong there, but again, it was a while I heard this news. I heard there was a lot of talk about banning crops because of the uh, yeah health hazard and the uh, accident hazard. Okay, that that could be part of why they've become such a meme. Yeah, and let's be honest, they, they do not pleasant to use. But a sheep? Yes. But the kind of wood to use? No. 
and they broke easily. <laughs> No flights. Okay. Hmm. Oh, can we get on? No, we cannot get on there. <laughs> yeah, the, the more I listen to Big, the more he just sounds like Duke Nukem putting up a stupid, uh, stupid accent. Mean. Oh, oops. I don't think I about to say this. As if Duke Nukem uh, decided to work in a kindergarten or something? Maybe. <laughs> Is this concerning? Yep. Like... We did it! Mm. But it told me it's a bit if he be good around kids. But my big concern is uh, how we be around uh, the staff. <laughs> now, he is, he can be clearly gentle when he wants to be, as he shows with these two. Gotcha, my darling Sonic. Amy, what are you doing here? Sonic, this time there's no way out of marrying me. And of course, he go right into a fight where he's not going to be gentle at all. <laughs> Wait. Wait, hold on. Uh, who are we talking about being who being gentle? Big. Amy, knock it oh off. yeah, big, There's yes. No time to play. Big, I can see being gentle. I'm talking about Duke Nukem. <laughs> yeah, he would he would be banned, pretty sure. Yeah, like it's Duke Nukem, i uh, feel like I'm not sure he will be good around kids. And we're worried about him being around the staff, especially if they are. Yeah, yeah. Off. <laughs> and big, one. Big, I can. I think I can trust Big around kids. <laughs> Maybe. Hmm. I wonder if Froggy is here. Okay, yeah, Nukem, Nukem would definitely go after some of the staff, but I think in general he would behave himself in front of the kids. <laughs> Still be probably somewhat of an asshole, but not a massive asshole. Okay, there um, might be some voice in the background, it's because there's visitors over. Uh, we... I can't believe he did that just so he could get away. Mr. Sonic must be really... Really? What? Oh, God. We already here. Yep. <laughs> we are be gonna make myself some food. <laughs> All right. my eyes from this. God, there we go. You know what? Just to be able to handle this, I'm gonna make myself some mini pizzas. <laughs> Want some? Uh, nah. It would take too long All to right. mail them over. <laughs> That's true, and I have, I have no mushrooms, sadly. Wow. Mm. So we'll be. Oh, well, don't die. Okay, so we can control those separately? Okay. Yep. Okay, we need to get up there. It, 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 come on. The yes, yes, shut up, Amy. Can you meet you? Come on, now. Yes, yes, Cream, we heard you. There we go. Okay, there's no need for the keys since we're on the first act. We can only get the Emerald Traces on the second one, so in the Bingo Highway, we will take a key if we find one. But yeah, you people can see people can see how easy it is to find those with Team Rose. I did not mean to rhyme. Yeah, come on, come on. 
There we go. One thing that I noticed there that also makes things easier for Team Rose with this is that the um, sort of Yes, yes. Mm. Is that the, the death zones on at, at the bottom of the uh, pinball yes, <laughs> tables are blocked off with bounce balls. And yeah, that's this one done already. I, I, I'm pretty sure they cut the levels in the hall. For Team Rose. Kind of super duper happy. And it is very easy to get high grades <laughs> with them as well. <clears throat> yep, 40 emblems collected. You can now play special mode special stage in two player mode. Okay. Not that we have any interest in that. Okay, bingo highway again. <laughs> Wait in a ball, move the control stick right and left to slightly change the direction of the ball. <laughs> yeah, the physics on how much you can actually move around with that seems to vary from moment to moment. Uh, yeah, that, that's one of the big mistakes with this game, is that the physics at times seem really inconsistent. Um. And yeah, we can, we can see that that actually is his umbrella and fishing rod in one. Gonna deal with that one. Okay, yep. got just a level. Oh well. Okay, careful not to fall. Thank you. Back for now. Welcome okay. back. Mini pizzas are in the microwave. Can we actually get most of these now? Uh, yep. <laughs> I'm pretty sure we got all but one there. And that's a bunch of brains gained. What? <laughs> What'd you say? But deafened from all the noises. I can't hear you, I got deafened by the rings! <laughs> yeah. Yeah, come on, keep moving. Yes, people, I know that was a stupid joke. I know. <laughs> yeah, you can bonk yourself for that. So I have my hands on the controllers. <laughs> With controller blade. I already bonked myself. <laughs> but at least I wasn't a pawn. <laughs> There's a uh, steal also, you, not a bad pawn. <laughs> I like how they just sit on his shoulders. <laughs> I said, no, no, no. I said, Cream is the only shine, right? Uh, yeah. Careful not to fall off. Uh, 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 nope. I yep. cannot have the right for I'll, I'll be concerned what the siblings will be named. Well, their chow is called cheese, so that joke is already made. Cream and cheese. Just mm. uh, I... Bloody heck, it'd be awkward if she, they had a twin named Pie. 
Okay. Like, imagine oh if Vanilla had the two kids, one's name is Cream and the other one is Pie. It would be even more awkward if they had a, a, a brother called Cracker. Cream Cracker. Oh. Oh, God. <laughs> so he's gonna pull me. Cream Pie? A while ago, at least the one I grew up with, was used a, as a sweet term of endearment, like a cutie pie and all that. Yeah. And Keepa was actually a compliment. And, and I found the hard internet. way that, yeah, internet has distorted to something else. And someone asked me why they call, I called them a cream pie. I thought, well, cream is a nice, wow. that was a nice white right. ice. It is called, is a endearment, right? And I just told me, oh, you don't know, do you? No one tell him, please! <laughs> and I thought, wait, what do you... Oh, God. Do you mean it has become something... One of those weird kinky things? Then please don't tell me! <laughs> Guess what happened? We're told. The husband of the guild master told me! <laughs> hey, okay. And guess what happened after that? But everyone else told. Be the guildmaster, who was the wife, punished him by taking a one of those bamboo samurai sword called Hooken and put a own what's one of his own own what's stuck on it and, and hit it against his nose. <laughs> And I just okay. want to warn you, they both are Dutch. <laughs> so yeah, I would not yeah. be surprised if you, you met them unknowingly. Well, <laughs> Netherlands is still a pretty big country, so... Yeah. Uh, true, but is there still that chance, you know? Yeah. That small chance. Okay, and we're getting an animal chase. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna stick the food down. Okay. Well, this is not going to be too much <clears throat> of interest, anyways. Good. <laughs> yep. Emerald challenge. Okay, let's see if I can get this stupid thing and not get screwed up by the, <laughs> the game just being wacky with things. Okay, oop. Yep. Straight into bombs. <laughs> From a speed path. <laughs> More speed boost at that. I, I did a countdown. I only reached to two before you messed up. Yeah, that was the game launching me into the speed <laughs> into the bombs itself. Sure, blame the game. Okay. Oh god, no time to do a emerald little... in it. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Now you're making me tend to do a little meme I've been learning of late. What then? It... Mm. It's a skill issue. <laughs> <laughs> but it feels a bit mean. <laughs> Uh, and all momentum lost. You, you can see how quickly just... these stupid things become a lot more common all around the place. Just to screw you up. And the fact that once you get up the wall, you're pretty much stuck there. And Baby, for some reason, decides to go the opposite direction. Yeah, I, I don't think we're catching the emerald. And this is just the third stage one. There's four more after. Oh. <laughs> Amy, get off the and fucking walls! Yeah, this is done. I I do not. I'm not even. I wasn't even touching anything there. She went up the fucking wall. Like if it was just one straight tunnel, then it'd be a lot more manageable because it twists and turns like a fucking pretzel. It just. Ugh. What the heck? Like, I'm kinda surprised. 
You guys again? Dr. Eggman! Him again. Past your bedtime, kiddies. Now to tuck you in. You <laughs> can't Okay. Stay out of our way. At least this should be easy. It, that's big. <laughs> this gets knocked over. Oh dear God. I want to say, I'm surprised we failed that one. I expected that them on the run would have been the easiest one. That was almost like the hardest one so far. There. Uh, I'm pretty sure that the later ones do get harder as well. But I might be. I might even just have to look up if I can find uh, a save file to import or something. Yeah, I'll still try whenever I can, and I'll probably try just with playing it with the keyboards. Because that might be easier. But, yeah, if need be, I'll just, <laughs> I'll just look up if I can find a safe file to import. Because you can see, you saw the bullshit I had to deal with. <laughs> and a loader in chat, Cosbox. I'm complaining about the special stages, not the not the difficulty of this. The Emerald challenges, which is just the controls are bullshit on. Uh, I think the meaning big, yeah. not Damn you. <laughs> and that was all three characters getting captured by the capture bots. Okay, that was aimed at big. Sorry about that. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, how, how are you doing today, Bot Co the Cosbox? I hope you're doing decent, if not well. Okay. Excuse my captain stumbling upon his words. Uh, over here is my co-commentator, Rakir. <laughs> yeah, welcome to the stream. Let's see, definitely not well. Got a sickness bug, okay. Okay, uh, I hope you recover from that soon enough. Uh, uh, Okay, how, how did only Big get hit there? Like, I... <laughs> he is the biggest target out of all of these. Why? Now, there we go. How is he carrying them both? <laughs> Perseverance. I think I was... I have to go to... about it this worry. <laughs> I feel sort of a dream here. And, yeah, she's flying around using her ears as well. <laughs> okay. There we go, that's those dealt with. That, that's someone getting very excited on the bouncer. Uh, let's see, still need to watch the Sonic the Hedgehog films. From what I've heard, both are good. Yeah. And, hmm. <laughs> there we go with the imaginary hula hoop again. Why are there so many of them? <clears throat> There's also something funny I found in the TV tropes for this uh, game. Oh. So it was it was spoilers, so I didn't f really look at it. But apparently, in the second uh, Sonic film, there is supposed to be a reference to Sonic Heroes or something. Mm, I smell Jesus, 
Big just flexing by standing on the rail, okay. <laughs> and yeah, I, I have heard, what, I think there's already a trailer out for a third Sonic movie. Yep. Okay. Reminds me, um, really again. You know, we thought we watched uh, Star Wars Red Bulls yesterday. Yeah. I saw the Nintendo computer and uh, what's on YouTube. Here's what I saw. What then? And apparently, two hours after you and me stopped watching, uh, they yeah. released Bad Bats 3, Bad Bats Season 3 trailer. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> right after we finished with it. <laughs> like a, a few days after we finished catching up on it. Yeah, I, I, so yeah, I just went to the to watch YouTube materials go. It was released two hours ago. Really? Okay. Really? <laughs> uh, Unless we hopefully we'll be able to finish watching Rebels before we finish that that way. It, it did say it was the final season. Oh, yeah, I did see that as well. I have not watched the trailer though. The same. I only got the support but on top there where someone will be there, so I'm not gonna say who. I'm guessing Darth Vader since I'm pretty sure he shows up in every single series. That one is rather obvious. <laughs> yeah, we'll see who else shows up. The biggest other chance is Ahsoka. Yeah. Well, yeah. Uh, let's see. Her in this in the yeah. first Sonic movie, of course, mostly about Sonic and such. Second one introduced Knuckles, and from what I know, number three is uh, going to introduce Shadow the Hedgehog. Yeah, so that's going to be interesting how they what they do with him. Yeah, not that. I think what I think I thought maybe also introduce. The rest of the robotic family. Okay. <laughs> he doesn't really have a family in much in the games. But actually, uh, there to be his van. I, I thought you meant a uh, more active family or such. But yeah, his grandfather and. Uh, Cousin. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Yep. Okay, good thing that we just find <laughs> that we just hit the checkpoint there. <clears throat> but yeah, Maria, his cousin. Uh, uh, yeah. If I recall correctly, she is called. Uh, yeah, ow. Jared Robotnik's uh, granddaughter. So yeah, that would make it. That would make them uh, cousins. Yep. Would have been awkward if she was his aunt or something. Okay. I, I do hope that if they continue with the movies, it, like, I I do hope that at some point they introduce Blaze the Cat and such. As long as they keep the momentum going and keep it. In, in good quality. Yeah. Not too bad, I guess. <laughs> Lowest grade so far. Do I... Oh, dear. I just be worried if they introduce... Uh, Robotnik's mother. <laughs> Look 
Okay, I, I did not actually expect to be able to get through that safely with a speed character. Wait, I, hold on. I just realized. Hmm? We already here. It's yep. not even been an hour yet. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Oh, so this has got to hurt on big. Okay. Yes, we got it, but Biggs, you got it. Okay. Here we go. Okay. Messed that up. Yeah, the, the ones with the lances are a threat too big if he's bouncing around, though, so we do get it, gotta keep that in mind. Okay. But yeah, you can see how short the levels are with Team Rose. So, yeah. If I want to retry for the animal challenges, it'll be by far the easiest to pick them to go find the, the keys and such. Yeah, the levels actually are short, so... Yeah, so there are actually some somewhat significant differences on the level <laughs> levels themselves between the characters. More in terms of length. <laughs> okay. <laughs> This is kind of cool that they the, he manages to switch fast enough to keep them on his shoulders. Just the opposite one. Here we go. Okay, are we going to get screwed over by the physics again here? Okay, I think we were about to if I hadn't pressed forwards and <laughs> the exit already. I, I, if, if the levels aren't cut by half, they're cut by like two thirds down or something. I saw Green just drop down at the hole. <laughs> there she can fly. Kind of super duper happy. <laughs> yeah, big isn't the one. Well, big isn't too big on big words. And time to pluck a bird again. I kind of wonder. Something weird in there. Jeez, you'll be reunited with Chocola very soon. Froggy too. Let's get him before Sonic does. Then he'll be head over heels for me. Ready, old cannon. Open fire. This is it. And yes, big hip bumps them to get them moving with the rocket XL. <laughs> Oop. Okay. Uh, right, uh, Protoss, what kind of cat is big based on? No, uh, so just general cat, I believe. Him. I want you to later go and look at your cat and look at the ears and tell me if you're sure about that. Okay. Make camera up. There. Okay. This just keeps showing that there are barriers to keep you from just running over, but in some places they're just play missing. Yeah, that is a concern. You somehow didn't get caught up in ow, in the rotors. Okay. Okay. Let's see if this will do something. And yes, there's. 
<clears throat> Just like how Team uh, Dark has a side effect with their Team Blast, so does Team Rose because they gain in invulnerability for a while. Okay. Nope. There we go. That's a balloon gone. Okay. Yep. And the last stage luckily has only a little bit of health. Yep. But we still get hit. You pay for this. All right. <laughs> They're really just trying to get into Hula Hoop with <laughs> just shoving at his Let's sides, go huh? Look for Froggy and Chocola now. And we know where this ends. Hey, it's just a stupid copy. Froggy, where are you? Let's go home. Cheese, what's wrong? A chow nap, but why? I'm not really sure, but betcha Dr. Eggman has something to do with it, and we're not going to let him get away with it. Come on, let's get out of here. Okie dokie. Huh. Okay, so you're the regular robot this time. Yeah, the game is a little bit weird with things like yeah. the fact that it doesn't. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> it sounds like Cream is uh... <laughs> uh, big uh, way of speech is rubbing off on her. <laughs> yeah, I I'm guessing since this this team is supposed to be for the youngest players. That they wanted to avoid something that looked like, even remotely, like blood. Yeah. And hello to Ranger Lashers. Hello, Lash. Hello, Lash. <laughs> okay, how are you doing today? Hello, Lash. Hello, Lash. How are you doing today? Okay. Hmm? Making my head Homesick. Okay. <laughs> Guessing you're off to somewhere then. Yeah. Okay, let's actually land on it this time. There we go. And <laughs> again, a big uh, is probably going to have a bit of a rash after this. <laughs> let's see. No, as I'm at at, at home sick. Okay, you you missed a bit. Uh, doing decent. We started early today. We're, we're not going to stop early, though, but I do have uh, a job interview tomorrow. I'll do my best. Uh -oh. so I'm not going to hold out too much hope for it, because, well, every time I've, you know, I have, I've thought a, a job interview went well, I kept getting disappointed. So, best to just keep low expectations. This means when it goes well, it is more enjoyable. Yeah. Yeah, pretty much what I've always, uh, what I've noticed is if they sit if towards the end, they say, uh, we'll contact you again soon, it basically always means you're never going to hear from them again. Yeah, because I'm thinking it, it feels rude. Yeah. Are you free? Uh. I think that I have heard that it's, it's illegal for them to do that. We didn't step in context, of course. Yeah. Let's see. Still go in and do your best. You've got my support. Thank you for that. It's not a big... It, it's basically just a... A stopgap job. At a moving company. So far from what I'm actively looking for with laboratory work and such. 
But yeah, it'll be, well, more income than Social Security, at least, hopefully. Okay. Yeah, I'm Steve. Every time you talk about working on love, I get, I get afraid. <laughs> Okay, and out. Well, the rest of the level can still be seen ahead. <laughs> oh, now you see how they shorted the level. Okay, you know what? It's clever. They just. They're not shrinking the level itself, they just move the goal closer. <laughs> Cream being adorable. <coughs> Let's see, last year's I've been stuck on the social security stuff for a while. In fairness, I live alone and don't exactly have major expenses, so I could live off of it. But having a software testing job nowadays really does help. And yeah, having more income also helps with, well, <laughs> when things go to I shit, like being sick. Yeah. Or if you need to buy something new that's a bit more expensive. <laughs> Also, most looking around, I've heard some. I've been hearing some jokes about this game being racist because the black frogs suck the ones that are destroying stuff. <laughs> Just jokes, not actual uh, <laughs> being offended about it or such. <laughs> Here's processing from the sounds of it, or rather not the sounds, or the lack of sounds. <laughs> I forgot to speak, actually. <laughs> I was gonna say, those lines did not age well. Yeah. And there, there's been a few line reads here that uh, were not <laughs> were not directed the best. Like back at casino, yeah, by the yeah, in the casino stage, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure uh, Amy's line of "Really, what?" was supposed to be read a lot more like uh, she was warning Amy to shut up and not to sound that curious. Because well, Cream was basically going to bathmouth Sonic. Though we we don't have any idea what Sonic actually did to get away. They were up. Ow. It's the first time we've got hit by those. Yeah, it's really obvious what Sonic did to get away. I just point the other way and say, look, a marriage counselor, or whatever. No, it's more easier than that. He ran. <laughs> Makes most sense, yeah. But he Give is the fastest hedgehog. Of course, he, he will use that skill to flee. <laughs> oh, see, gosh, last... my brain. <laughs> yeah, last year. yeah, this yeah, this game has okay, but occasionally weird voice work. Yeah. Here we go. <laughs> uh, people wondering what you might bring your sleep. I just imagine Sonic wow. as a member oh, of no. White Scars in Warhammer. Three <laughs> <laughs> in vulnerability. <laughs> But they have both something in common. Overall about speed. <laughs> and there's the end. Right. Let's see, it doesn't help that the characters frequently just don't shut up at that as well. <laughs> Look at all those Eggman's robots. Thanks, Tails. <laughs> Captain Obvious. 69 Rick. No. Tell no, don't tell everyone about that cream. Don't. Flashers, apparently they got an actual six year old to voice tales. Okay. But he's supposed to be eight. Okay, here we go with this again. Let me explain a few things. I'm not holding out hope that I'll actually get the stupid emeralds. 
Yeah, unless the game is like expecting me to make much smaller movements with this or something. Let's see, maybe just not holding forward will also help a bit. There. Okay, here we go. You'd be really good at catching the animal so far until you're good to eat me. This is weird. Up the, up the, uh. I really don't get why it's just so eager to get up the bloody walls. Which also slows down. Okay. Now I'll check chat in a sec because I saw it move. We are actually closer now than we were before, so we are making... Is this actually partially working? Even though this one is supposed to be harder. Uh, Hubris. <laughs> My name is Hillian. Uh, I can't read the chat here. Uh, Those... Uh, I... Can the characters each go up and down so all day over the years they each might as well be on trampoline? From what I heard, they try be, they've been trying to keep the Sonic's age stagnant as possible. So let's on, try to lean more. more but refuse to let him age. Okay. Yep, yep, yep. Okay, we might still catch it. We just need to have the game cooperate. Oh, he's uh, From what I heard, nope. he's supposed... Uh, somebody did count out that he sh should be 19 since each anniversary is supposed to be his birthday. Excuse but he keep... Me, miss. I was wondering if I could ask you something. If it's about a date, it'll have to wait. Date? You think this is a joke, you little brat? Now hand over that child nice and easy. I bet you you're the one who took chocolate chow. What? It's not nice to tease my friends. Yeah, time to rock and roll! What the heck? Uh, yeah, the first time we're actually going to... Actually, not the first time, but... <laughs> yeah, we'll see. Uh, how <laughs> That's how these two get along, not... There's gotta be a major misunderstanding here. But we can't back down now. Here we go! Uh, yeah, we'll see. Oh, but I did a research, but there's a lot of big about it. They made, made him 60 walls, and otherwise they tried to keep him 15. But there was one time he was 17. And of course, we're getting stun locked now. But I think it was in the recent news to recently that they decided to just remove the age completely. Yeah, let's get at least one of them out of the ring. And that's their team attack. What? Just play music Rainbow. absolutely horrendously. Oh, uh, let's see here. Yeah. This is from Nash. Sometimes 15 or something 19. Yeah, I will say 19 should have been the new channel to age. If Stega use. Well, yeah. That was a lot easier with Amy. Can Charmy know who Charmy is? Charmy is an amazing example on Sorry, introduction. But there's you're no supposed, time for this. Supposed to be 16 or 17. Then Sonic Heroes Arbitrary says, No, wait, he's 6 or 7. That's quite dumb. Yeah. This made things awkward for the comics because Charmy has been established character for, there for a while. Yeah, that's a... It... Okay. I think we're lost. Oh, this place is creepy. Come on, you guys. Don't you want to find Chocola and Froggy? We can do this. I've got a good tub for all of us. Mm. <laughs> right, I was going to say it's... My turn. It's annoying when it comes to sight if they're supposed to be one year old. Like, uh, like between the 
say 15, then they say 17, then say 16. That's annoying for this to like on here, get over or under. But what did she say here? That's worse. That's like adding, just removing 10 years. What? Yeah. And That's from what I heard in the, the comic, they did him like dirty that. with that because they basically just quote unquote solved that by giving him massive head trauma and brain damage. Uh, yeah, did I miss something? They got decided to just remove the eight completely. Says most of the characters seem to be more adults now. Hello. Uh, but they clearly should have. But instead, they wanted to keep him 16, 15. But he clearly should have been, by their own words, each anniversary a birthday, so he should have been by now 18 or 19. The <laughs> Sonic, that is. Uh, but he had his 30th yeah, anniversary some that. time ago, so he'd be 48. Wait, 48? What? Yeah, you, you were talking about that if every year was his uh, his birthday, and he started out at like... The, uh, no, that... Okay. And then, again, you have to think about what sort of five-year anniversary, ten-year anniversaries. Oh, yeah, there's that. Oh, oh. Yeah, so probably for, ten, for I'm said, presuming. Uh, yeah, the YouTuber counted the uh, official anniversaries, and they yeah, came up to uh, 18 or 19. Okay, let's see. Lazarus, and yep, the writer at the time, Ian Flynn, has noted he's still embarrassed at how insensitively he handled the charming situation, but apparently he was very much rushed by Sega to resolve the problem yep. in a very short amount of time, so brain damage it was. Yeah. Yeah. Sometimes, here's an example. Sometimes a bad decision is forced upon a person due to time constraints. Hmm. Yeah. I think I've said this before. Small death... Uh, short deadlines usually do a lot of harm. Yeah, because it forces things to be rushed. Which, well, will deliver the exact opposite of the quality. And it isn't quality, it isn't quantity. <laughs> Yeah. I just knew we could do it. <clears throat> I don't actually know how if they resolved that with Charmy at any point. I know I saw a video about it at at, if, at one point. Uh, so I don't actually know if he's still considered brain damaged or if they quote unquote fixed that at one point, which probably would be considered okay. as insensitive. Actually. <laughs> I'm gonna have to ask, who is Charmy? Right Charmy is the bee from the Team Chaotix. My turn. Oh. <laughs> so yeah, the the kid bee. <laughs> I was stoked about them getting into a fight. Yep. There. And again, just this absolute bop of a, of a song. <laughs> are you the only guard here on how that? Yep, you are. Hmm. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Uh, like Ken nope, Pender's lawsuits forcing Flynn to write a universe raid boot which sucks. Is that the Genesis wave? Uh, and of course, uh, no, 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 come back. Now, Charmy was mostly kept sidelined, and with the universe reboot, that whole side plot was basically retconned anyway, so the kind of problem, yeah, problem kind of went away. Okay, yeah, that point is basically just to ignore it ever happened. 
And of course, Archie Comics no longer has the rights to make Sonic Comics. Yep. No, actually, we, we don't need to fight at all. Are you snoop because the rumors were hiding in the paintings? Yeah, it's not that they were hiding in the paintings. The, the implication is supposed to be that the, the paintings came to life. Uh, uh. <laughs> oh yeah, I wish I find annoying when a company reviews like Simpsons. I couldn't care less, and it's just a comedy. It's not. It's mostly joke based, but something like Pokemon. I actually got annoyed that they never age Ash. But he should obviously be an adult by now. <laughs> Yeah, there's plenty of theories, both serious and non-serious, about that. <laughs> like that he's <laughs> just not human or something, or stuck in an eternal time loop. Of some... Really? They, they could go with a real-life condition. I forgot its name, but it's... It has a lot of issues, uh, like... Yeah. Of, uh, what was it? I thought what it, it's actually triggering something the hormones that are supposed to trigger for puberty does not activate, so you basically stop. Yeah. As a 12 year old. That was good. Let's see, and of course, Archie Comics no longer has the rights to make Sonic Comics. They're published by IDW now and are their own universe now, so that problem doesn't apply. Okay. And yeah, the Super Genesis Wave storyline reset the universe, coincidentally kicking all the characters not created by the current writers. Okay. I think I have a... Yeah, I think I actually picked up something for, on the Genesis Wave. Uh, I'm not sure how you'd call it, a trade back or a collection. Yeah, I, I'm pretty sure I picked that up at some point. Uh, uh, Amy, what... Uh, seriously, now we're just dealing with random slowdown on this as well? I, I I honestly hope that whoever des designed these got fired. Because they're not challenging, they're just plain broken. Actually, I... If this Chaos Emeralds be are too hard to get, or too much of a frustration to get, and I can't find uh, a safe file to... Seriously, see... Just freaking what slow as all hell on the walls. <laughs> Fuck it. Uh, yeah. they, they are completely broken. Yeah. I see you struggle sometimes with emeralds with other characters, we were able to catch them nonetheless. But why is Amy's one that's supposed to... Yeah, it's not the characters, it's the tunnels. The tunnels are broken. Yeah! Please return to Come on, It's the tunnels that are broken with random slowdown and random... Just... Yeah, I'm going to guess that. Wait. Is the tunnels character-based or they just level-based? They're the same always. It's the same okay. challenge for every team no matter what. Okay, yeah, okay, then they definitely all out uh, tunnels are broken. Yeah. If I, if I can't get the stupid emeralds myself and can't find a safe ball either, uh, I, I say we, at the end we just look up the cinematics and maybe a coverage of the boss fights as well. But I'm not going to waste too much time on something that's clearly does not freaking work. Yeah, do I wonder... Hmm... Were it broken to begin with, or did... Did it become broken to emulator? I'm pretty sure they were broken from the start, because I'm... On my... Uh, 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 oh, come on... On my original copy for the PC, they were also just an author hell. Anyways, oh, okay. uh, Lazarus, the, 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 yeah, the Super Genesis Wave storyline reset to the, yeah. Right. Uh, 
consistency. There were two Genesis Wave storylines, one that led to a soft reboot, one that led to a hard reboot. In the end, it was kind of inevitable, especially Ken Penn's uh, stuff, thanks to his bullshit, had become utterly toxic. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Now let's try and focus on this again before I just get too fr frustrated from the special stages bullshit. Hmm. Okay. Okay. At least this shouldn't be too much of a frustration as the previous uh, versions of this. Since, well, again, we're playing as Team Rose. <laughs> the easy modes. It's still mine! And we all agree on this level. <laughs> we might be able to finish this entire campaign in one go. But then we'll probably get stuck on the Chaotix for two or three, because they have special objectives that need to be fulfilled. Yeah, but still, they're able to finish these ones campaign in two and a half hours? I would say it's rather good. Here we but, go. Uh, yeah, I'm... <laughs> Well, it definitely were the easy ones this time. <clears throat> oh dear. But, yeah, I'm I'm actually uh, still in the mode with all those handball things. But I, I will Is take... No, it's not finished yet. But I will... I will take a uh, uh, silver lining when it comes. Yeah. And that will be if we finish this in the same stream we started it. <laughs> okay. Again, don't ask how we got up here or how Team Rose even knew about the fleet since it never saw it. It's kind of scary. Really, game? Uh, yeah. This game's major and um, most major problems are just the fact that. The uh, falling barriers are just missing at certain points, and the fact that the rails and faces can just throw you all over the place. Yeah, uh, I feel like that, that actually. They, I feel like got taunted by the game. It said, it said we better not fall off. What happens? Immediately fall off. Yeah. Uh, I feel like the game took the piece at you. Oh, okay, we can bring those up with big. It's a, a special, a special uh, mechanic introduced just for big. Oh, that's kind of nice, actually. Okay, because he's he's the only one with actually no, he's not the only one. Uh, Vector also bounces, so we'll have to see if those appear for Team Chaotix as well. Uh, Amy, you've been saying the same thing for like every other level or so. I mean, I zoomed out over what you said. But I did, while well, I was reading Lazarus' uh, text here, and... Oh boy, that is indeed a concern. I think that's actually... Might be kind of counting how you've been having it so far, Hill. Let's see. 
Uh, yeah, for me, one of the major problems with Sonic Heroes is that with the exception of the first level, everything is a bottomless pit. Uh, all of my deaths in this game, 99% are just falling into oblivion, yeah. I'm not going to count them, and I have had a, a few deaths to enemies, but yeah, just falling into the abyss is like the, the vast majority. Yeah, like, it has got to go that the enemies are not the danger, it's the environment. But yeah, and just that, broken, like, I, 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 uh, broken edge barriers as well. Yeah, I, yeah. I think one of the reasons why it's so easy to slip off with power characters is that with their attacks, or at least the attacks that lunge around, uh, their speed gets set to a value that's above what the barriers can actually stop, or something like that. Or they're, they're made... The friction on their movement is lowered so much by the attacks that they just override the barriers or something like that. Possibly. Yeah. Oh, uh, what did I have to say? Oh yeah, what environmental hazard is a thing that it's okay to have the environment to be dangerous? But having that the environment 90% of the time is the thing that kills you and not the enemy? Yeah, that just speaks of bad design. Yeah. <laughs> but that, that just means that your foes are extremely easy. While your environment are boss levels themselves. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> yeah, for, for the most part, I still like it. Nope. They they should have made these barriers like the, the like the gates that force you into a certain formation. Yep. Yeah, I, I still overall like the game. Again, but it's but it has some serious faults. And that, I, I will fully admit to that. But then, I, I, then again, I might just be biased because this is likely the first of the Sonic games that I ever played. Really, a, <laughs> a life preserver? Well, it's not preserving well, no, no, any no, life no, in this. No, 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 no. You, you missed the, what just happened. <laughs> Wow. It was a burning life preserver. <laughs> Here we go. What, what, what would be the opposite of a life preserver? A death preserver? <laughs> okay. Actually, I think I know what uh, the opposite of a life preserver would be. <laughs> what? An, an anchor? Yes. So, I was thinking about Anvil, but Anchor works fine. <laughs> or cement right. shoes. Yep. <laughs> just as it left, just as Lasher sends that. Hmm. Let's see. Uh, maybe, but I'm hardly going to criticize you for liking this game. There's very good stuff here. Yeah, like the reintroduction of the Chaotix. And yeah, the music. But that's just a general thing with Sonic games, so that's technically that doesn't count. <laughs> Even Big uh, isn't too big of a fan of his own game. Oh dear. Uh, you know what I, uh, I need? I did not mind. Why did I say that with an accent? Because whenever you say pint, you are legally obliged. Yeah, I, I played too much Warcraft 3 as a kid. <laughs> well, you don't have to wander any more big. <laughs> yeah, I better get in at rain 4. You didn't even start the level before falling off. Thank you. Yeah. 
No, we should not go <laughs> wrong way, big. Here we are. Shouldn't we be down there? Yes, oh, yes, please, we get it. It's overwhelming. And of course, <laughs> Big's turn, Big it turns into a Pokemon again. That also works. Here we go. Okay. <clears throat> And by the time that sentence would be done, the ground would already be gone. Okay. Again, just prove that there are just the, the fall barriers, that they just don't work. Uh, a lot of the time. Okay. Let's let's see if we can get to the special stage and see what absolute hell awaits us if we try to get the seventh emerald. There we go. No. That also, apparently those are called Egg Hammers, which probably should have been very obvious from the very start. <laughs> hmm? Okay, for a moment I feared that it would throw me over the edge again. Yeah, th this game's obsession with rails is also... Too late. <laughs> oh no, that was perfectly right. Was meant for being launched. And I'm back. <laughs> Welcome back. Oh my god! And I'm pretty sure what that's that. Yeah, that was Amy going. Oh my god. Which I believe is like one of the only times she ever does that. You mean she just went? Run again! Eggman, robots are everywhere! What are we gonna do? Here we go! Now, I wouldn't say that she confirmed that there is a god, just that there is religion in it. There we go. Okay, why, why put that right in front of that? Anyways, time to play with the lasers. Yeah. And referencing back to adventure. Uh oh, we're gonna hit it. Yep. Well, no lasers for us, it seems. I will be disappointed if you somehow. Full off without hitting that damn gold thing. Let's see, last year's actually come to think of it, Dr. Robotnik already did in Sonic Adventure. It's Chaos, the god of destruction, yay hammy overacting. <laughs> oh dear. That looks so uh, super, super, nice. super happy! You know what I told you there's a fan coming about Sonic and Amy coming to take a dinner and have kids? Right? Yeah. Apparently there is a, I don't know if it's an official cartoon, game, or comic, but that where Sonic actually had kids, and is a father, and is a king? Okay, what fresh hell are we going to see here? No, no, it's not fresh hell. Yeah, recycled <laughs> hell. No, no, no. Do you expect anything to be fresh down there with all the sunflower? <laughs> wait, 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 you, wait, hold on. You, you think the scent of rotten egg is fresh? No. <laughs> okay, what? Where my point stands? <laughs> that was just random slowdown. Oh, oh. On the. <laughs> 
Okay, I, I really Nick just do not get what the hell is up with these tubes. <sighs> there actually seems to be less bombs here for once. Even though this thing just twists and turns even more than usual, which... Again, the moment we get forced up the wall, we lose speeds. And, well, this. Really? Putting bombs at the end of an open lane? Okay. Pretty sure we're not going to get it, but I'll at least still try. And now it's actually forcing us up onto the ceiling. Oh my eyes get annoyed from this. And we lose our momentum because we just fall down from the ceiling. Okay, we could have had that if it hadn't pulled that at the end there. Ugh. Yeah. Okay, from Lash, can confirm the Orky Comics had a possible future line in which, yes, Sonic was a kid and had two kids. Truth not with Amy. I'm not surprised about that part. As I suspect, the Amy was a fan one. You could have gone A, B, C there, Eggman. <laughs> oh, good God, you're right. Um, let's see here what else Lash has written. Oh, fuck, though. Then, current writer of the comics, Ken Andrews, intended for his 25th years, year latest mm -hmm. story line to be the only canon future. It was. Insanely that word and bull that were over many characters. Oh I'm gonna suspect people did not like that one. Yeah. Okay. There we go. Just blow them right into his smug face or smack right into his crotch. Okay. It's 21 and 11. <laughs> yeah, we still have plenty of time before after this. Okay. We may have time to actually spark it! The chaotix! <laughs> On the same damn stream! <laughs> actually, this is easier. <laughs> yep. Never mind, moving on. Okay, dodge those. Should be invulnerable during this. There we go. Okay. Have to catch oh. up. Apparently, in that Sony comic, the future star line, the bot was not defeated by Sonic. Okay. He was defeated by Knuckles. Oh, that was Ken's Baby. favorite character. There we go. Okay, I could see how that would piss off the fans since, well, Sonic is kind of the main character. It would be a nice subversion, but still. It, it, it's called Sonic. <laughs> Sonic the Hedgehog, not Knuckles. He actually had his own uh, comic for a bit, I think. Okay, you take this. Yep. <laughs> Again, as we just shoved the umbrella into his crotch. And there we go. Let's see, not the way Pinders wrote it, trust me on this. And... <laughs> 
I've only given tiny examples of why Penders is an incredibly shit writer. The worst stuff is stuff I will not discuss in other streams chats because of you know, some of it gets very disgusting. Okay, yeah, thank you for that. So the chase begins anew. We still have 45 minutes remaining. Yep. <laughs> we went through that like, what, 10 times faster? Probably I am happy we went started earlier, since that means we have more energy to finish off a game without real overtime and all that. Yes, I did not expect us to actually finish it this quickly. I thought we maybe had maybe one more stream or something, but. Nope. And the only one who was actually annoying, the well, mostly annoying, was the damn emerald levels. Yeah, I, I really failed to see how that got past uh, quality, uh, quality insurance and such. Let's see, any Unless... story is by far the shortest of the four. Most levels are made shorter for easy mode as well, yeah. Like, they're like... At maximum half the length, <laughs> sometimes maybe a third of the length. <laughs> okay. Well, yeah, this was. I get. That's something odd with this game because it's very clear that this game was made or intended for a younger audience, but then you compare that to. Well, just how ball bustingly hard the freaking emerald chases are. Like, how is that supposed to make sense? Yeah. Hmm. <sighs> and John St. John, in the voice actor again with Big the Cat, which will remain eternally hilarious to me. We has had more roles than uh, Duke Nukem and uh, Big the Cat. We had, we had other ones that were kind of surprising. <laughs> None I can remember at the moment. But yeah. With Team Rose done, we'll move on to, well, what were previously my favorite characters in the entire fandom. <laughs> Uh, as, no? to who is, as to who currently is my favorite character, I, I think I might have mentioned. I think I have mentioned it before, but well, we'll get to see some other time, perhaps. It, wait, it's not Blaze? Uh, yeah, right. Yeah, it is Blaze. But uh, like I said, the Kyrgyz were previously my favorite characters, but then Blaze showed up <laughs> and kicked them down a notch. All right, for well, uh, I. You spoke in a way that made me wonder, wait, it's not Blaze? <laughs> I'm pretty sure you've been telling about Blaze a lot already. <laughs> yeah. Uh, anyway, so let's see. Lashra's Duke Nukem, aka Big the Cat, is amazing, yes? I probably don't need to know who my favorite character is. Um, let me guess, it's Cheese? <laughs> yeah, I know, it's Zag Man. <laughs> Sagman? Really? Eggman. <laughs> you really need to get your ears cleared sometimes. <laughs> but yeah, I this... actually was gonna yeah. blame the mics. <laughs> but yeah, a lot of stuff with this game also just feels disjointed. Like, yeah. They expect you to play through all four campaigns, but well, Team Rose is so freaking easy that it's clearly meant for people who basically are playing platformers for the first time in their very short lives. And, well, Team Dark will kick your ass. 
Yeah, yeah. It's, like, it's like they were expecting people of different age groups to share the game. Uh, but yeah, let's get started with these knuckleheads. If, if the game will... If the game were to not randomly just get selected, be selected there. Yeah, and uh, last just wrote something. Quite a first impression, huh? Yeah, I just realized I've not read it out by Espio. <laughs> okay, how so? Uh, yeah, mission find ten hermit crafts. Yeah, I just realized. Now what are we gonna do? Bring it on! Ready. <laughs> But here's the thing. My introduction to SPU was through uh, Umanatomic. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and when he dressed up and so I thought, okay, SPU, maybe he has a bit of a mild Spanish accent and such. I did not expect him to have this dog voice. <laughs> yeah, let's see, what? He has a hermit crap? Lazarus. Oh. Team Rose was apparently intended to be the first storyline so you could learn the rope, but they decided to change the round because Sonic was the main character. Also, I'm gonna be honest, I hate the chaotic storyline because they're all missions and some of them are utter bullshit. Yeah, I, I fully agree on that. Like, you, we saw it right here. They hide some of the things you need to find out of the way. And it's not like you... It's not like there's, like, 20 or something in the entire mission. There are 10 specifically in the mission, and you need to find all 10 of them. Yeah, I don't need to confess something. I, for a short moment, I mistook the Herbie Crab for something else. <laughs> but you mistook it for uh, Lash's opinion of the chaotic story? Yeah, I actually mistook it for a pile of shit. <laughs> But yeah, as you can see, the Chaotix have, well, a special ability with Charmy that he can open those up. So I don't think we'll see them too often. Okay. There. Okay. Yeah, I I'm just going to avoid the keys wherever possible because I'm already sick of this special stage. Like, they were, they were supposed to be top in the original games, and in general this game is a bit of a a, a, a callback to the old games with their structure. But, yeah, they did not do it well in a lot of F things. Yeah, like, how do the same thing, all the characters fine? But having to have get all the emeralds for the true final boss, but they are so hard. Yeah, sorry, no. Like most kids, like okay, m many kids would probably have enough time to do that, but probably they probably would lose interest before we get to it. Yeah, and they would would only do it. If they play love so no, there will be a secret boss. Okay. Well, most kids will not even know it. And that's why they will not try it. Here we go. Yep. I had a feeling there'd be something. Actually, I don't know if it's if there's only specifically ten hermit crabs or so, but it's a 
It's not a big, much bigger number than 10 if there are extras. Also, hello. hello. <laughs> First thing we can push in the entire game, I think. Now. But yeah, the thing is, if you can't find all the things... Yeah. Yeah, uh, but if you can't find all the things before the end of the level, uh, you get looped all the way back. And there's no no real indications of uh, how you're of where the others are supposed to be. Oh no! So yeah, just another very glaring bad design choice. Why, were, why do we put this skin on stream, to stream list again? <laughs> because it's the closest thing to Sonic Adventure 3 up at the moment. I'll take the lead. There. So don't ask me how an organic bee activates a robotic flower. Come on. I will not put a robotic flower, more a mechanical flower. Here we go. No. Let's move on. We need two more crabs. Well, what other way is there to go, Vector? Okay. Oh, come on! Yeah, at least maybe a crab or two down here, here then. Oh, nope, yep. Okay, I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure there's going to be more than ten in the level. Hopefully. You, oh, you already just did. What? I just ran one of the bots over with the ruin? Yep. Uh, one for survive the first uh, block, but not the, uh, the second one. Also, there. Forgot to do that. Uh, that. Why does that look like a reference? Uh, yeah, I still really like these goofballs, even though you know, their appearances are rare. Actually, that might be a part of it. <laughs> they haven't had too many op uh, opportunities to ruin them. Oh, I don't recognize that voice. And of course, both of them aren't quiet. And now for Espio's gimmick. Yeah, he's a ninja, so yeah, he can go invisible. And while well, he's a chameleon. Yeah, I mean, I have to say, a chameleon as a ninja makes sense. Throat <laughs> wise. So, chameleon is. And yes, he hovers by blowing a giant bubblegum bamboo. Here we go! In the name of all... Okay. Now, we, we have to find a single freaking Chow in this entire map. So, yeah, well, I'm guessing he's going to be in a hidden area somewhere. Yeah. yeah. All right, now it's just say, I, I recognize the voice from the walkie-talkie. Who? Oh. I think I know who it is. Okay. Oh, let's see if these detectives are smart enough to figure it out as well. And yes, Amy is literally the only character who can't do that move. 
That is obviously Oscar. Your cat. Okay. Have ow. You just hurled yourself into a lawns. <laughs> That's a level. Okay, no Wait. chow here. Wait, hold on. What? Why are you keeping them both in... How else is he going to spit them out to launch at the enemy? Let's see. No chow here. <laughs> Yuki are just utterly baffled. What strong arms! He can just throw them! Boy. <laughs> because an alligator's uh, or crocodile's jaws are even stronger. They are strong, yes, but they don't use. Crocs are not known for spitting! They know for ripping and tearing, death row, snapping. Well, bombing. this one is known for that. And that was the chow. Ugh, just these idiots. No complaints! Well, I've still got plenty of complaints, but not about uh, the chaotics at the moment. <clears> hmm. <throat> hmm. Actually, maybe I'll have to look if the emulator maybe has cheats for the game or something to basically make it re well a lot easier. So, you're the ones who are playing games with my army. Sorry, just part of the job. That's the evil genius, Doctor Eggman. Doctor who? Yes. No. Let me show you who I read. They really went there. Yes. Yep. Okay. I, I believe difficulty-wise, I I think the chaos are considered to, to be bit in between uh, Team Sonic and Team Dark. So, like a medium difficulty. Oh. Yep. Basically, you start with Amy, then the team. The, you start with Team yep. Rose, then you go to Chaotix, then you go to Sonic, then you go to Dark. Yes. I would. I put the Chaotix uh, before Team Dark. So Rose, Sonic, uh, Chaotix, and then Dark. All right. Let's go. Mm. Okay, here we go. Yep. <laughs> I don't know what causes these bounces, but well, it makes it rather easy to break him. All right. <laughs> Let's see. Yeah, the, the difficulty isn't too high. It's more than having to deal with your patience being eaten alive by the level objectives. Yeah. I do like that they have specific uh, reactions <laughs> for the bosses, which I believe differ per character. It's a small thing, but still a nice thing. Oh yeah. Uh, oh, clear out, clear out all enemies in the city. I'm going to guess that is going to take a while. Not too late to change your mind. Why do you think we're here? How else are we gonna make the rest? Let's go! Here's your next mission. Destroy all of Eggman's robots holding the city. Every single one of them. I'll take the lead. Yeah, every single one. So we'll need to find each and every one of these robotic bastards. I'll take the lead. Okay. 
At least the, the missions we vary, it seems, then. Yeah. But this is going to be an absolute pain in the neck if we miss any. Oh, God. Okay. There we go. <clears throat> okay. That's another. <clears throat> Suspicious machines must be stealing something from that pipe. <laughs> okay, nothing hidden in there. Okay, but luckily we have a counter. Okay, but it isn't going to help us if we miss any, of course. Like these two, we could have easily missed those. All right. Yep. Eggman robust <laughs> Eggman's assassins. Uh, <laughs> you might want to read the script again, SPO. Okay, now I confirm they have done mess ups. So, yeah. But I saw earlier was definitely likely that the the voice actor said Omachao's name wrong. <laughs> Okay, we got all three this time. <laughs> I think that's the first one of those. But maybe the second? No, <laughs> not a third in the, any case. Okay. Let's see, 54 more to go. 53. I, I just uh, 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 well, I've been pondering this for a while, actually. I... Uh, uh, no more see why I cannot like Vector and SPO? Mm hmm? Like, normally in ca cartoons like these, if, that, if, if, if it's a red tile, it's a bad guy. But not these two. Yep. This is really refreshing. Do it again. That wasn't a trend mostly uh, coming from. Uh, well, Western cartoons. <laughs> In a Japanese manga and anime such. If it was a reptile, was it wasn't a necessary evil? It could be anything, really. Okay, I think I got all of those there. If not, we'll be coming around again. Yeah, no, I, I should clarify. There are exceptions, like. If it, it, it is a, if it is a Western cartoon about dinosaurs, then they of course not gonna make every dinosaur evil. Yeah, just uh, a good deal of them. Yeah, or at least but enough you, to you sell know, toys. You, yeah, but you do get what I mean, like that. In Western uh, cartoons, reptiles are you very extremely commonly yeah. put into the uh, evil. Yeah, because of the whole cold blood of thing and such. Here we go. Yeah. Hmm. Let's go. Uh, come on. Well, yeah. After after this stream, I'll go look around for any way to cheese out to the special the diamond chase, not the diamond the emerald chases. The thing I check back. Or if there is a way to, well, just get a save file that already has the emeralds. That, that's what uh, Ross Scott uh, from the YouTube channel Accursed Farms did when he did a video uh, on this game. But that was the PC version, I believe. And that oh. one will work on modern systems. If that was a mistake. Oh, Can I still get back? Romance was something I've learned recently. Yep. Apparently, Windows 10 and up will only work for uh, Steam now. Okay. So, yep, nope. if you have a Windows 8 or Windows 7 and such, you may not no longer be able to use Steam. 
Okay, we're supposed yeah, we're supposed to use vector here. There. Yep, yep, yep. Out. There was a there was a booster underneath to act as a failed save. Okay. At least it counts them as destroyed already. So the game is a bit merciful there. Yep. Okay. <laughs> that also works. Yep, yep. One's below. Okay. Sixteen to go. Oh, I just promise it is. I, I, I do know about the turtles, people. I do know about uh, that they are heroes. Most often, yeah. Ooh. But my point is that it's very extremely common for Western to make reptiles villains. But I mean, and I repeat, extremely common. Not always. Yeah. But bloody common. There are always exceptions. And yeah, whenever SPO goes invisible, the other two just stay behind. And yes, there are there are going to be some levels that are going to be well stealth missions. Let's go, boy. It doesn't want to go. Anytime you're ready. Let's go. Okay, nine to go. There was a key there, but again, no interest. It, no interest in the special stages. Okay. Yep. There. Seven. Yep. 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 Espio, attack them. Okay. Four to go. Now let's hope you aren't just hidden away somewhere. There. Two. Did we get all of them in our first run? Yep. Oh, yep, we did. Okay, so these two are going to special treatment. Good job. Mission complete. And yeah, the special effect of the Chaotix uh, Team Blast is that they get rings for every enemy they destroy with it. performance, I'd say. <laughs> oh, well, could have been worse. There, there, Captain. There, there. At least we got through it in one go. Now, what is the next mission? Three gold turtle robots. Okay. Let's see. Last show's right at the beginning. <laughs> See, last right, I'm beginning to feel worse again. I think I'm gonna go back in be to bed in a few. Good luck with the game. Yeah, thank you and good luck with recovering. Yeah, thank you, Lars, and do get well. Rest yeah. properly and drink, uh, yep. drink water and all that. Yeah. Here we go. Charlie, we'll leave the flying and use the undershoot. Okay, see you next time, Lash. Okay. If I remember correctly, these robots are supposed to be in our paths. Hmm, or maybe not. It's... Okay, I'm guessing they might be hidden away behind locked uh, things. But they are something something here. If the emeralds get too painful to do... I probably would be okay to just skip this to final boss. Ninja power. Okay, I, I, I think that's, uh, <clears throat> I think that's power is the return point for if we hit the end of the stage. So that probably means that there's no, 
uh, golden turtles b well, before that point. Alright. Okay. Do you okay with skipping the final boss if it's too much of a hassle? Yeah. Oh, and there it is. There's the first one. Uh, yeah, we can, we can just look up footage if, the, if, if it comes to that. Yeah, that's the thing. I'm gonna show you. Like, you're gonna need to remember to make sure you write up the uh, YouTuber's name you look up the video from. Yeah, accreditation and such. Yeah, not just saying. You, you may actually need to edit the name in. Yeah. Or will you skip it entirely and don't do it at all? If people want to see, see the final boss thing, they can play the game themselves or watch someone else play it. Yeah, we can, we can just put it in, we can just uh, watch it on the... Uh, yeah. I'll yeah. look around for footage of it and then we can just uh, play it on the monitor if need be. It just feels so wrong to do that. Uh, we've done it once before with MDK2, but that was because, well, otherwise we'd be re just repeating the same level uh, another two times. That, then again, that's what we've been doing with three, <laughs> three fourths of this game so far. Hmm. Why yeah, is this not extended? Even, the only times we did that, I did not feel comfortable. Okay. Mm. Yeah, we'll, we'll see what uh, what uh, what we'll have to do. I'll try it. I'll try it with keyboard first to make the controlling easier. If that doesn't work, I'll see if the emulator has cheats or something that we can use. I look for cheats. Well, cheats will be easiest. Yeah. Otherwise, maybe a save file. And if all of that fails, then. We go uh, look up the footage on YouTube or such. Yeah, do I want to? How many of the emeralds do we have? We have two. The, the start, the save file keeps track at the start when you would get to select one. But only two? Yep, we have two of seven. I see two. Here we go. I thought we had at least five. Nope. So yeah, you can see how that would be painful. And, and you saw just how freaking annoying the, just the third one gets. Yeah, I'm... Oh, bloody hell, I almost got a headache from that! So, uh, I'm, I'm not wearing my winter socks at the moment. The window is open. Uh, how do you put those on again? Okay. okay, for a moment I thought that it was sending us back to the start, but no. Just skipping the entirety of the elevator. Okay. But yeah, one drawback about Espio's attack with that is that it's in place. So, yeah, we can't launch it forwards and it doesn't auto-home onto a target. So you need to jump onto the enemy that you want to use it on. Wait, what? You send an enemy home? No, it doesn't home in. <laughs> okay. There. Okay, where are... I think we missed one of them because Espio said he sends gold, but I didn't see anything too obvious about where it might be hidden. Sends gold? He's a ninja, he can pull any sort of <laughs> bullshit trick out of his ass. No, really. <laughs> okay. No, even if we did miss one, at least the stage is cleared, so we don't have to bother with enemies on the second run. Yep. 
Okay. Now, the, the first one was practically delivered on a silver platter, so where are the other ones going to be? Yep. Well, not there. There. Let's keep on moving. Yep. Uh, hello. Okay. That, pretty sure that wasn't supposed to happen. Wait, what color was that turtle? Normal. But <laughs> it just got launched out of nowhere. Like all of those rings, which I'm probably going to lose. Oh well, we, we technically just need one. Okay. Is this one sending us back? Nope. Nope. Oh, there. Wait. Yep, there it is. Okay, so they are presenting them. Nope. Oh, those are the one switches. That's actually no, that's the exit point from earlier. Uh, where might the switch for that one be? Then again, <laughs> that'll work. <laughs> Just. A private concert that's so bad that it self-destructs. <laughs> Alright, one more. Now for that one we do need to go back. Oh, or not. Okay, I I'm guessing there are more more of these than we actually need to <laughs> than we actually need to kill. Oh, come on. We need to Oh, okay, it looks like Espio will kickflip those things on his own. <laughs> okay. Oh, well, I actually paid attention to what they were saying. I, no, I was not able to hear what Be the other said. Focus and prepare yourself. I didn't notice what Shormi was singing, though. <laughs> yeah, he was just basically singing his own name. Yeah, B B B, charming B. Man, who are those creeps over there? What's up, SBO? And you are. Just what do you think you're doing here? Who's this fraud? Our client's adversary, perhaps. You mean the bad guy? You guys don't fool me. I know what you're after. Better stay out of my way. Once again, poor communication <laughs> leads to another brawl. I'll hmm. find Eggman's treasure first. <laughs> okay, what was that all about, <laughs> Omega? Yeah, what the heck is that all about? I, mean, I just realized, what is SP of Ruin? Roger. Massive shurikens that are bigger than he is. <laughs> but really, <laughs> Omega, that's a load of my back. You won't get off so easily next time. Are you gonna be? For me? <laughs> <sighs> Anyways, win 200 rings. Win? Yep. I think it just means get 200. Let me go! Let me go! I wanna play! Fancy play! Where there's light, there's shadow. Really a pest of luck. But yeah, basically, 
don't get hit or get really lucky at the slot machine. Oh no. Do we really ought to win if we get enough? We should. And luckily, for once, this big thing over here will come in use if we can get into it. As it is. If we ought to win, we get enough, that's good for. 200, getting 200 rings should be doable. But we'll know it to try to make sure you don't lose the 200 rings when returning. I'm pretty sure once we hit 200, the, the mission ends right there. Yeah, oh, that's on. what I'm hoping for. But the other version I told you would just be... Yeah, you heard yourself. You get yeah. to the points, you need to survive to the end of the level with those. And it's a Sonic game. You see the problem. Yeah, one hit. Yeah, yeah, shut up, Charmy. But, yeah, I have to say, out of all the Chaotix, uh, Charmy is the one who went through the biggest change, besides the fact that the, they, they de-aged him by a decade. Uh, by the fact that, well, <laughs> in, the original, in his original appearance, he was the actual size of a bee. So, yeah. They made him a decade younger and gave him experimental growth serum whilst they were at it. My dick, this thing is just too... Uh. <laughs> okay, we just need to get a, yep. a few more lucky combos. Yeah, oh god, we have time is remaining. Uh, oh yeah, five minutes. Uh, yeah, should be able to finish this mission. Yep. And yeah, Oop. come on, get me out of this place. I want to go to the bigger one. Nope. Yep. Yes, shut up, Charmy. Uh, yeah, we should be able to finish this only eight, um, 80 more. So unless we get unlucky and lose all of them. Yeah. <laughs> Come on. Game. Uh, again, I just do not understand the physics of this. Like, some. Pretty sure we weren't supposed to be able to get into that from the bottom. The physics are just real wonky at times. It, uh, okay, at least he's yeah, still moving point. forwards. Wait, there is a turn correct case in point. Yeah, I think. I'm not too sure, actually, but I think if... Really? As you mentioned how... wonky it is, it is very wonky. Here we go! Okay, at least Charmy is in a safe spot, so if Vector falls off the map, at least we'll have Charmy still. Okay, there. Okay. Come on. Shut up, Charmy. What actually happened to SPO? He fell off the boards. So he currently does not exist. <laughs> or is waiting for a revive. Sometimes it lets you influence which way you go a, a hell of a lot, but other times, no matter how much you push to this any direction, it just will not let you move. Uh, really? Oh, come on. Okay, we were warned about that earlier in the game. Uh, really, nothing for two Sonics, but we do get points for two Knuckles. Okay. Let's just try and get to... Uh, really, only 20? And we get back here, okay. Now we're back to where we just were. Okay. Here we go. That, that's not. <laughs> okay. 
where do we get... Okay, that's where we get fired with Espio. Nope. Which actually leads right into here. Okay. Yes, shut up, Charmy. That's going to be a new line, huh? Just shut up, Charmy. Yeah, and... I know you've been saying that you like the music, but... I got nothing to confess here. And this one you definitely don't like? Yeah, I don't like it. Yeah, I don't like the this casino music here. Yeah, you don't you don't like the casino bits uh, in general, so <laughs> makes sense. Okay, yeah. get in there. there. Come on. Okay. So Vector got himself stuck in there, so let's see if we can get a double payout then. Come on. Mm. Okay, let, let's give this 10 minutes for overtime. If if we don't finish the level by then, we call it on, we call it on it. You say that when my eyes are getting heavy. <laughs> okay, why did the bouncing itself seems to be utterly random at times as well. There, uh, no. Bloody, I'm, I'm, I'm talking to go brush my teeth while you do this. <laughs> go ahead. Yeah, so there. I will not be able to talk for a short moment, people, so be right back. Yeah, I don't think you'd even want to talk with, well, the noise of Vector being stuck in the slot machine. <laughs> there we go. Okay. What is taking you will make to be a stock machine? There. Seriously, with. Okay, there. No. Shut up, Charmy. Okay. There probably is a spot that's where it's easier to do this, but we're already here. And we get automatically thrown into that cannon anyways. Okay. There we go. Oh. 30 for three knuckles. Okay. And again, too slow on that. Okay. And then we try it. This flipper here. There. Okay, 20 more. It completely missed there. Okay. Okay, at least they were able to use these rings for rent. <laughs> Okay, and that, it, entering this with Charmy is just bad because it does not launch you far at all. Okay, can I get... Yep. Mother... Yeah, I, I think we can guess how Eggman does get most of the, that money, though. Okay, come on. There. Okay, got only ten. There. No. no. Okay. Hmm. Actually, with, with the team blast giving rings, that's that's a few. Maybe I should go look for some enemies to actually ball blast. Turn into rings, and hopefully that'll be enough. So I'll have to get out of here first. Let's see. Will I be even able to get it to the exit? It, not like that. It is open. Hmm. Okay, maybe it is better to just try and stick with this thing then. Oop. Unless... no. Nothing. 
Okay. Mm. Yeah. Oh, come on, no. <laughs> Didn't even put me in it. Uh, as long as we don't get Eggman again, this should be doable. I'll s oh, right, yeah, go those give rings as well. Uh, are there any more of those to break around? But there's two up there. That's, and there's a yellow one there. Okay. Uh, yeah, this is the most reliable way. Just use the left clipper to get into here. Face through that. There. Mm -mm. Yeah, no. Yeah. Yeah. What even happened there? That's ten. Okay, let, let's just try and break that loss <laughs> one more and just have the rings. Eleven minutes already on this. Almost twelve. Here we go. And I'm back. Welcome back. Just need ten more rings. Yes, Robotnik stole another ten, another fifty. Cut. Yeah, screw it. Oh, if we get hit, we need to get all the way back. So, there. <laughs> and yeah, finish upon getting to 100. Okay. Hmm. It's weird. I actually went well, to brush my teeth while you struggled. <laughs> okay, at least that's done. So next time we can continue on the bingo highway. Collect 10 casino chips. Okay. Yeah, that'll be for next time. Okay, how much progress was that on the, on this campaign? Let's see, 34% about, okay. It's kind of makes sense considering we had about 45 minutes to play them. Yeah. Uh, <clears throat> yeah, we'll, Wait. yeah, we'll get most of the rest in the next stream then. And yeah, then we'll likely have one more stream to finish them up, and well, one maybe after that to, well, <laughs> if we can't you know, get if we can't get the stupid emeralds easily enough, we'll need yeah definitely one more on that. <clears throat> yeah, I just realized if we if we got that much percentage on about forty minutes with five. Would that mean we would almost be done with it if... In yeah, one more stream, it. maybe, depending on how hard it is to find some of the things we need to find. But yeah. yeah. Off stream, I'll probably try to get the other emeralds uh, with Team Rose, since it was well, so much easier to get the key and the end with them. But yeah, next time we will be continuing with Team Chaotix. But for now, we're going to look for someone to raid. Uh, let me see. Probably best if I just pick someone since we're already over time. Uh, let's see. Momodora Moonlit Farewell. Can't say I've heard of that. Let me triple check that everything is muted. There. Uh, of course, a lot of people are playing Pal World. 3 Jack is playing Dead by Daylight. I'm seeing a game called Silica. Ready or not. Actually, not included. Uh, any others here? Uh, Pizza is doing a chatting stream at the moment. Uh, 
I think we raided Ren the Wolf recently. Um, I looked over raid Smo Smoop's other nonsense. I think it's been a while since we raided them. Uh, I think so. Okay, cut that out. Then head on. The okay, that's freaking out a bit. Okay, there. Go to the channel. Slash raid and paste. But before we start, of course, thank you everyone else who has been watching now or later. Uh, thank you, Lazarus. Thank you. Uh, I think this crawl flies up a bit. Huh? Yeah, Dark Knight Luigi and Cosbox. Thank you all for watching. Do we have any lurkers around? Uh, no, that's a very obvious bot name, so I'll have to delete that one or report it. And uh, yep, yeah, thank you as always, Takir. You're welcome, to us, my friend. Thank you all for watching here or on YouTube. Yeah. And yeah. Tomorrow, maybe Valheim stream, if uh, I'll, I'll, I'll very likely be back in time after the uh, job interview, but you never know if something may not, may or may not get in the, in the way and such. And well, it also depends if Glacier Boy is up for more. <clears throat> yeah. As I say, those three people, you never know, like, I could get sick, he could get sick, they could get, uh, he, Glacier Boy could get sick. So any other thing that could happen? Yeah, so for now, at the very least, we'll likely have another stream of this game on Thursday. But for now, uh, let's get that raid started. Uh, there. Okay. And yeah, thank you all again for watching. And until next time, have a nice day. And until then. Peace everyone. Uh, watch out for undead seagulls. And Eggman's robots. That too. Hehehehehehe <laughs>